All right, all right, all right. Welcome back to another video, guys. My name is White Morpheus, and today we're looking at the 55th ranked player in all of the NFL, would you believe, for the year of 2022. His name is Joel. Joel Betonio. I'm thinking that is uh, Italian, um, being that, you know, I've watched a fair few episodes of Kitchen Nightmares, and a lot of them are Italian, but they're not really Italian, are they? Or at least they're not really cooking Italian cuisine. Um, but, you know, all of that and more will be revealed. Number 55 on the list. He's a guard. He plays for the Browns. And uh, we've got a fellow guard, Wyatt Teller, who we've seen earlier on the list. The man with the best hairstyle thus far. You know what? Let's get into it. And the myth, the legend. Couple good blocks the there. man, Antonio the with myth, a nice block. the I legend. I want to know what goes through Kareem Jackson's mind, all 5'10", 183 pounds of them, when 6'4", 320 of Joel Batonio's Yeah, this ain't good. And, well, I know it went through his mind. He ended up... Well, it could have been a lot worse. Right on his back. It Absolute could have been stuff. a lot worse. It will be second down and 10. Chubb running to the right. Got a block. Cut back 35. And he Oosh. spills down the... So that's why Nick Chubb got so many yards. What a there. beautiful block. If the back follows you on that play, it's gone. Go outside, right? Yeah. That's the point. Absolutely. When Joe Batonio leads the way, it's a running back's personal escort to the end zone. Oh. Touchdown! Tell you what. Batonio does as good a job as anybody when he pulls 75 right there. He took the back of Joel Batonio and said, giddy up, 75. Tell you what, the Browns did have two absolutely elite running backs last year, no doubt. Let's go. Batonio. And until you see a video like this, you don't realize why they were so elite, why they got so many yards. Um, well, it's most probably going to be something to do with the offensive line. It's the one that Joel's been a guy that I think is really underrated, and I would imagine he's pretty high rated on this list. Lyman rarely get the spotlight. A top 100 debut at number 55 is an achievement for big guys everywhere. I'm a guy, we need more linemen, you know, at the top of the list. I think what some of the, you know, offensive linemen and defensive linemen do is, is pretty special. Oh, uh, you had Joel Petonio out front. That's a pretty good lead blocker for you. I think Joel the players certainly know Petonio. how good Joel is. You want to, you know, impress your teammates, you know? You, you want to impress the guys you're playing against and, you know, at least have their respect. Joel Batonio. Uh, Joel, yeah, yeah, big strong, Joel, yeah, bro. Holy shit! I thought Mike Daniels was wide. Christian Barmore. Type guy, you don't want to leave your chest open because he would break your chest open. He's really strong. Good protection. Oh, man, he had all time. Oh, beautiful pocket. You're shit! Right. Definitely, um... One of Iron Man Joel's best abilities is his availability. But what am I going to say? He, uh, he bided his quarterback time. That's all I was going to say. This year he came up to me after the season and he gives me a fist bump. He goes, hey, congratulations. Uh, for what? He goes, you played every snap this year. I said, that's amazing. I, I would, didn't even notice. I was like, congratulations to you too. Uh, you know, we played every game together. That means that you did too. He goes, yeah, yeah, this is your four of doing that. I said, <laughs> oh. You're an Iron Man, Joel. You're an Iron Man. Big game for us. <laughs> oh, how good. Matters in the trenches. It's on us every week. Let's go. Trench on three. One, two, three, trench. Oh, trench on three. One, two, three, trench. I don't know, man. I don't. Uh, honestly, I don't know if I want to be in the trenches, man. I have really don't. Room. I think that he's one of the best. I mean, I've ever uh, seen. I you know, we talked about that. World War One and World War Two. Like this is the 2021 NFL season, and it seems just as intense. Look, that's no, that's no disrespect to it to anyone out there. Look, um. Should I have said that? Should I not have? I'm going to say what I want. Um, yeah, in the trenches, holy shit. Love to the big guys, you know what I mean? That's that's what we're, uh, Respect. we're about here. <laughs> Respect. Look, if you were in the trenches in World War One and World War Two, you would be high on meth. So at least that would be something. Um, look, we're not here to talk about that. But uh, in the next video, we're talking about Jeffrey Simmons, DT for the Titans. Top 100 players of 2022. Number 54. <sighs> Can you tell I'm almost finished? My name is White Morpheus. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.